I can't believe it's already St. Patrick's Day, and I have a plan. I always get this nasty little leprechaun that runs around my house and destroys my room and everything. But this is all going to change because I'm going to capture that leprechaun. Okay, I finally figured out a way to capture the leprechaun. And I feel like it's going to work. So first... We take a box and then we would put under it a like in the background we could do like a scene. We can like make it a rainbow in the sky and then we could leave a trail or something of corn pops because those would look like gold under it, under the rainbow, and then there could be a little stick. With the stick, he could knock over the stick, and then the box would fall down, and then we'd catch him. It's a perfect plan. I'm going to put one in my room, but I'm going to put it only in my room, only because he always goes in my room. And not really anywhere else. He just goes in my room. He has the thing. He has the thing about my room. It's kind of weird, but he only does my room. And so I'm going to catch him. The trap is set. So here's the main trap. Down here, you can't see it, but there you go. It's like... A rainbow with a pot of gold, and then, oh, and then the port, the corn pops. So I have a trail leading all the way to the door. So then he'll walk in. He'll see the trail. He'll follow the trail, and then as he gets that one and bends over, he'll knock over this, which will close on him, so then he can't ruin my room. Flawless. And I have my room all clean. I have to go to a friend's house. That's why I really set this trap, because, well, I don't want anything happening while I'm gone. So I guess I gotta go now. I got the perfect plan to run Emily's room. Hehe. <laughs> this is the perfect. I mean, the green wins. Like always. Hehe. <laughs> you really thought that she could trap me? Hehe. <laughs> no way. All her craft stuff is in here. I guess time to ruin it. Hee <laughs> hee. Technically empty. I'm done with that. Hee <laughs> hee. My job is definitely done here. Hee <laughs> hee. mess. First, there's a sorry game, and the, the lids and everything are all messed up. Here's post-it notes, and the trip didn't work. Oh, man. Well, actually, he might be under there. I'm gonna see. But first, still, my crafts are all over the floor. Same with my hats. They're even back there. My LPS are in random places. Ugh. 
Okay, let's see if this leprechaun is under here. I personally think the leprechaun is here because he ate the trail. And I don't see any leftovers of the corn pops. But let's see. Nothing? Not even a little bit inside? Nothing. Oh my gosh. That didn't work at all. Well, I guess I gotta go clean up my room now because somebody got away with eating everything and messing up my room. So I guess I gotta go clean my room. So, yeah. Leprechauns are a pain. Hey guys, it is Emily here, and I hope you like Sammy's video that was posted on Sunday, Tori's video that was posted yesterday on Monday, my video that was posted today, Sam's video that was posted on Wednesday, uh, Olivia's video that will, that was that will be posted on Thursday, Abby's video that will be posted on Friday. And Ella's video that she will be posting on Saturday. Jeez, that's a little mouthful. So I hope you enjoyed my video. And to get a shout out in next week's video, comment down below who you think was the leprechaun. And yes, I did mess up my room after I just cleaned it. Yeah, I gotta go fix that now. Anyways, I hope you stay a... I hope you stay a cool cat. And, yeah. Bye. Er. Bye.